Hello everybody, welcome back to another Disney Pixar Cars video on my channel. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day and welcome back. And in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at Hot Rod River Scott from the Disney Pixar Cars 2021 Diecast series. Now of course, this is new for 2021. I believe he was either in case B or case C. So that is very amazing. I am extremely happy to, that I got this guy. Uh, that I found him in a store, so that is very, very amazing. But yeah, let's just get straight into the review. Now first, we're going to take a look at him in his packaging. Of course, he's got the new uh, 2021. Not very nice. And then, of course, there's the Cars logo as well. He's only like the Desert Horizon packaging, or Yellow Desert Horizon, whatever, they, whatever they're calling it. Desert Fade Horizon. Not really sure what they're calling it. Of course, you got that nice little artwork right there. You can clearly see that as like pretty much just artwork from the movie. Very nice. And of course, he's got the metal logo off the side there as well. On the very back of the diecast here, you guys can see he was made in Thailand with some of the other cars in the back as well, such as Kathy Copter, JD McPillar, Cruz Ramirez, Pilot, Jimbo, Taco, and Pit Crew member Fillmore. Of course, as seen in Cars 3. I mean, very, very amazing. Can't wait to get this guy open. And let's do it right now. Straight into the unboxing. Okay, everybody. So here we have Hot Rod River Scott outside of the package. I mean, a very amazing looking diecast overall. And yeah, let's not waste any more time. Let's get straight into the unboxing. I mean, not unboxing. Sorry about that. Review. <laughs> now, of course, River Scott. Let me just get it focused for you guys. There we go. Of course, he's got a nice little smile expression. Happy to be in Radiator Springs with everyone else and having a nice new paint job. He's got like a little mustache plate, whatever it's called, on the front of the car there. You can see his little headlights are covered up as well. So that's very nice as two. Then, of course, on his eyes, you guys can see he's got some nice brown eyes. He's got a nice little black outline, which kind of really makes him stand out a little bit more. Of course, his tires are nice, old, old style racing tires, old school tires. Black with red and white rims. And these, those tires look very, very nice. Then they got some other logos in it. Which you can't really read, a little bit too small for me. Very nice. Of course, he's just like the same model type as Duke Coulter's and like, um, what would it, what was it? Morgan, like Floyd Morgan. Yeah, they're pretty much like the same model type. Well, similar, very similar, probably not the exact same. Of course, right there you guys can see all like the little inner workings of his car, engine and all that stuff. Very, very cool. Then, of course, the main detail is that he's got some nice little flames off the side. That makes him look very cool. The flames just stand out, which I think are really amazing. There's two different shades. So, there's, like, light blue and then a little bit darker blue. So, that's very cool as well. He's got his windows. And then, on the very back, he's got his little license plate reading MCNC Me. Very, very amazing. And, uh... Yeah, he's just like a nice little light blue color. So that's very, very cool. Down on the bottom, you guys can see he was made in Thailand by Mattel. Very, very nice. Now, of course, he is actually very similar to his other release. I'm just going to grab his other release right now. Um, so yeah, this release is actually kind of quite similar to his... Heyday release. You can see the paint jobs are very similar. The only difference is he's got like his racing numbers and all that stuff. Because this is back when he was racing. So his little designs are pretty different. But uh, yeah, I mean, River Scott's definitely a very amazing die cast. I only have the new ones, which are like the Heyday one and the Hot Rod one. I don't have the original one. And that is the same with Louise Nash. I don't have her hot rod, which is being be, going to be coming out soon. I don't have her normal form either. I don't 
think she was released as a heyday car, so I'm not sure if she was or not, but um, yeah, that, that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys did enjoy it. Uh, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!